Welcome to Gas Up the Pacer. I'm Armando. That's Lou. And today we're going to talk about Patrick Mahomes. This is this is what I wanted to do because all everybody's talking about is, you know, Patrick Mahomes got half a billion dollars. And when when's the the first time we're going to see somebody get a billion dollar contract? I want to break this down for some people, okay? Because if let, let we'll start with this: if a major league baseball player and an NFL player both sign a, a four year deal for a hundred million dollars, the chances the baseball player gets a hundred million dollars are hundred percent. The chances yeah, the absolutely. football player the chances the football player actually makes a hundred million dollars on that contract is almost zero percent. Because that's thing just guaranteed is a signing bonus. Exactly. That's how the contracts work in the NFL. And if you think they just send them a piece of paper, like a one-sheeter that just says, this is each year what you're going to get paid, you are sadly mistaken. Because this contract I read was 117 pages long. There's <laughs> bills that they pass in government that aren't 117 pages long. <laughs> okay? <laughs> So I just wanted to dive in and break it down. And before we get into it, if you want to reach out uh, to Lou or I, you can reach out to me on Twitter. It's at Junior D's. You can reach out to Lou at Sweet Lou 3434. Mm, mm, mm. Music to my ears. <laughs> and that's, that's if I don't get hacked again this week. <laughs> hey, so, you get all that figured out because they had the, the Russians got you good this week, buddy. The 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 the, the you Russians have a blank screen on everything. The Russians hacked my uh, my Twitter account like three weeks ago when I was in Florida, or two weeks ago, whenever that was. And then the other day, I, I want to say it was like Friday or something. Um, they so it was about almost a week ago. They yeah. somebody hacked into my Facebook account and everything's deleted. So oh, it was a blank screen. Yeah, I mean, yeah. just so you know, you already, you already, you already voted. So don't waste your time. <laughs> I'm just, <laughs> I'm just waiting for like, I don't know, dirty videos. There's, or something. there's no need just, for you to go to the poll. There's no need for you to go to the polls in November. I'm just your saying, if I, been cast, buddy. if I if I get arrested for <laughs> voting 17 times, you guys know what happened. My shit got hacked. <laughs> I went through and deleted all my social media. The only thing I kept was Twitter. And then once Facebook, because I had to go through, I basically had to prove, like, to submit to a DNA test to prove it was me on Facebook. And they're like, cool, thanks for your blood uh, and your spit. We'll, uh, it'll take us two <laughs> weeks to get your, your shit back up and running. So I thought this was the internet. They're, they're acting like I, I'm sending them snail mail. But... Whatever. <laughs> so you send your information, carry your picture. Whew. Next it's been, nothing uh, takes two weeks. It's, it's no, nothing. You can order something now. It's four o'clock. You can order something now on Amazon and have it to you by 10 o'clock in the morning. Absolutely. What takes two weeks? I can order a car online and, and get it to me yeah, in two days. <laughs> They'll bring it to you in 48 hours. But Facebook you can't get your account set up for two weeks. No, yeah, you've Mark's, already voted. Mark Zuckerberg's the fucking 17 devil. Seventeen times. <laughs> you're, you're probably gonna vote two hundred times this year. You're probably going to jail. That's a good place for you because I know you've done something wrong. <laughs> I'm not telling you what, man. You're catching up for longest time. <laughs> so let's get into this Patrick Mahomes deal. So Mahomes signs this five hundred and three million dollar deal. Right off the bat, dollars. you you got to take some money off the top because the deal, it's a $450 million extension to yes. what he has left on his two-year deal. So he has two years and $27 million left on his rookie deal. So that gets you to $477 million. The rest of it to get to 503 is incentives on winning Super Bowls and AFC championships and all this other stuff. But yeah. Mahomes has $63 million in fully guaranteed money. That's it. 
$63 million in fully guaranteed, $141 million in injury guarantees. Yeah, he's better off getting hurt. $140 million and go away. <laughs> this is this is all according to Albert Breer, right? The he has fifty and well sixty million dollars coming to him in twenty twenty seven. And how this whole thing breaks out, because at the for the first question a lot of people ask, Kansas City Chiefs fans, uh, and other people in the uh, AFC West were are they gonna be cap strong? Like, are are we going to be able to sign other players, and or 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 are we going to lose players because of this dude's contract? And the answer is no. At least for the first three or four years, the answer is yeah, no. They're in a window and they're trying to win because his salary for the next two years, and this is on his rookie deal, is eight hundred twenty-five thousand dollars and nine hundred ninety thousand dollars. After yep. that, his Base salary, 1.5, 5.5 million, 2.5, 2.5, 2.5. His salary doesn't jump up to 10 million until 2027. So that's not where he's making his money. Where they yeah. loaded all the money was into the roster bonuses. Yes. So starting He'll in make 20- all of his money in March and April. Yes. And starting in 2021. Which basically the first two years of the roster bonus, uh, according to Albert Breer, the roster bonuses vest one to two years in advance. So he'll basically get that roster bonus for next year, this year. Yeah. So that's how that works. But where he's going to make the, the big dollars is in these roster bonuses. $21 million next year, 27 34 34 38 and then it gets into like the 38 39 40 million dollars but that's five years little, from now it's a little ridiculous yeah but you still have him only making 22 million dollars next year 29 million the year after with the roster bonus it jumps up to like 40 but it, it's you still have about four to five years to win with him before yeah. and, and when it starts to kick in before where it you starts get to get tricky with it exactly and then you get into like the creative math when it starts to get tricky they'll go back to him and go hey because this is all we we talk about <laughs> optics and a lot of things this is all about optics we're gonna make you the, the highest paid quarterback on twitter in the history of sports, and the what, they, what they basically did, yeah, what both sides did, they sat down and said, "Do you want to be a chief until you retire?" He said, "Yes." They said, "We want you to be a chief until you retire. You just won us a Super Bowl. I think that might have been their third Super Bowl title or whatever it was, second or third. But nonetheless, they both agreed that they wanted to be there. They didn't want to him haul around them with it, so they locked up the years. Yeah, they'll figure the money out as they go. Yes." If he went first off, if he wins another Super Bowl, he's going to make more than five hundred million dollars in his career. Oh God, yeah. And he'll get, I mean, just just this doesn't count endorsements. He'll make exactly. a billion in endorsements because yep. he's a super seems like a super good kid. So he'll make a billion in endorsements, and he will get five hundred million dollars out of them. It just won't be off for this one contract. They will just keep restructuring it, bonuses, exactly. restructure bonus, and over the next fifteen years. I know this was for 12, but over 15, they'll pay him $500 million. Yeah. Or let's just say he they he doesn't get the 500. Brother going to get 300? <laughs> he going to get money. Listen, once you, once you're at about that 2 300 mil mark, does it even matter? I mean, at I the mean, end I of the tell day, you from experience, no. A dollar's a dollar's a dollar. <laughs> but at the end of the day, whether I have th- if I have three hundred million, and you want to continue to pay me and give me that two hundred extra million, ah, okay, I'm not going to say no, but do yeah. I really need it? No. But I, but I, you know what I can do? I know I'm going to get my milk at. So if you say you don't really want to give me that, and if we win, say if they win another two or three Super Bowls with him, people will be screaming for him to get more. He might want to do him a solid on his way out the door 
and play for less because he has made about a billion dollars between endorsements in his contract. Yeah. So he might just say, I played the last couple of years because he's going to be on the downslide like they all, all are. Oh, yeah. And he might just say, he might just say, you know, just give me $10 million this year and I'll play. I'll play this year and next year for $10, 15000000 million apiece and be done with it. Yeah. I mean, I well, can't see that happening. And but every, very well made. every quarterback goes through this too, especially the, the big-time quarterbacks. You get, you know, especially later on in their career, they – Dan Marino did it. Montana did it. All these guys did it towards the end of their careers where they continue to get these big contracts and continue to get paid. But mm-hmm. then it starts to hamstring the team – and then they go, you know what? Just backload it. Just backload it so we can win now. Put it. Put all my money at, at the end of this contract so you can sign more yep. people now. And they continue every single year. I remember, you know, being in high school and into college, and Marino would restructure his contract every single year to free up more yeah. money so they can go get free agents and, and do that. That's essentially what I'm what I'm watching Ben do now. Every year yeah. his contract gets changed. Every yeah. year, but he still walks away with twenty million dollars between the roster bonus and the contract. Yeah, so he's making his money. It's just not as how they're locking him up for years. Yeah, that that's all it really boils down to is the years. Well, let me ask you this: with this contract being as big as it is, um, and again, the number, the five hundred three million dollar number, is what people see. Yeah. What does this, you know, like obviously we said, he's not going to make $50 million a year for the next 10 years. That's just not going to happen. $50 million. <laughs> so what does this do? Because you got guys like Dak Prescott that are on deck. And you got guys like that. Well, people now, quit mentioning Dak's name in the same conversation as this kid. Well, That's what's cracking me up. But he's on deck. Me too. I would say a Lamar Jackson before I would say Dak Prescott. Yeah. Well, you got other guys you like Lamar that are, yeah. you know, and I again, I'm not going to put many of these guys in the same class as Mahomes. He's just a better quarterback. Just but, a better quarterback, yeah. You know, you got Dak, you got Lamar, you got Josh Allen. Again, I'm not saying Josh Allen is is that good, but this contract, like they should all be calling Mahomes and thanking him. Because this is affecting all of those. Oh, guys. absolutely! And because what it is is, oh, go ahead. No, I was just going to say it, it's not going to make them. You know, Dak might want forty million, but it's it's not going to get them that forty million a year mark. But instead of seventeen, they might get twenty two, and instead of twenty two, they might get twenty seven. It's it's impacting well, their contracts in a positive way. Yeah, where I looked at it as, I didn't even really look at the money for those other quarterbacks because that's just ridiculous money uh, yeah. when you look at the figure. I mean, you are worth what somebody pay you. What I looked at was dude got 10 to 12 years out of it. So that's where to help the other quarterbacks that's young like him. Because they may say, I know you can't give me 500, but you can give me 200 over 10 years like he got. So at least I know I'm here for 10 years. Lock yeah. up the years and I know I have a job. If you cut me, it, then it's up to them, their agent, who's a lawyer, to write in the contract that if they get cut, they are due so much more money. Yep. You know, it might not be the full contract, but say if I sign for $200 million, which Lamar Jackson probably will, um, which is crazy, $200 million, but he'll probably sign for $200 million. If he'll probably get 60, 60 to sign, something crazy. So that leaves him 140 well, after five years, if he just completely tanks and they want to get rid of him, they, they can cut him if they want, but they own $20 million a day to cut him. Yep. So he will have made, what, uh, 60, probably another 20, that's 80, plus he'll probably have made 120 out of that 200. But you had a 10-year deal that laid with that number that allowed you to do that. That's what you'll start to see. Nobody else is getting $500 million. Unless if Lamar Jackson can win the next two Super Bowls, he the next five hundred million dollar man. <laughs> yeah. It's exactly. just that simple. Yeah, it's that simple. But the Chiefs are working on this contract because this is crazy. Yeah. No, absolutely, absolutely. Well, do you have anything else on the Mahomes deal? No, that's no, that's about it for him. I mean. 
I'm just saying, I got a good business idea, Patrick. You give me a call. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, trust me. He changed his number the day this came out. He cha- he's already he changed his number twice. Coming up. <laughs> yeah. He, he running around with burner phones now because he <laughs> know all you relatives coming out. Exactly. All right. Well, for Lou, I'm Armando. This is Gas Up the Pacer. We'll see you guys next week. Yeah, yeah, yeah.